Hello team and uh, welcome back to uh, Ships Ahoy. So I'm jumping in. I want to just kind of chill out, play a little bit. I know I'm behind schedule. Uh, you'll be seeing this probably way after the video should actually be up. But I mean, hey, uh, that, that's that's life. I can't do anything about that now. The most I can do is play. Um, I went off and I actually found uh, a couple sheep so that we can start getting more, um, ah, what's the word I'm looking for? wolves that we can actually populate the sails. So that's going to be a process and a half. However, I'm going to look to get these guys kind of rolling. So I'm going to start that process now. Um, so I'll go off and do that and I'll let you know uh, where we get to. Ah, look at all of our nice food. It looks so pretty up there on the wall like that. All right, while the uh, sheep are regrowing their wool and stuff and getting hungry hopefully so that we can make more sheep um i'm gonna get started on chopping down some more trees as you can see the the farm has grown up a lot okay so i think i actually need some more sheep because you can get different colored sheep and bring them back and then dye them actually on their coat to be a different color which doesn't quite make sense genetically but i'm gonna go try and find some sheep because i think before we've had a small enough population where they grow old too quickly using the hungry animals mod i think is what it's called i'm not gonna look now because i don't quite have time i gotta keep moving but uh yeah there's our buddies there's the mining like spot i don't know if there's a village around here haven't explored too far um gone down this way a ways i think there's actually a village off there but either way um i need to find another couple sheep such that the like essentially it's a viable population size for you know survivability the sheep there's enough of them that they keep making more sheep before they all pass on oh i thought there was some more sheep down here <laughs> keeping my ears peeled that's nasty um i'll let you know when i find them okay so i poked around a little bit and the only one that i'm finding is a couple of baby sheep over here which is actually kind of sad. But these little buggers, I think, are going to be impossible to catch. Oh, shoot, because of that. Where'd you go? There he is. Okay, all right, and... Yes, got one. Now, I thought... Yeah, there's the other one. All right, so now we have to kind of sneak up on him. And then hope he doesn't go shooting off. Okay, wait, there he is, there he is. Okay, come on, come on. That's, oh, there he is. Oh, God. Yes. 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 We got them both. Okay. Now we got to get them back to base. And this could be a dangerous kind of a thing because they are hard to keep up with you. But I think. So I don't exactly know how lead physics work in Minecraft. That's the interesting thing is because if their mass is so low that they just kind of get dragged with me no matter what, that's a good thing. If instead they are heavy i think the lead breaks but either way i'll see you back at base when i get there hey and look at that i think the theory was correct they just kind of kept getting dragged with me um so that was a good thing they just kind of kept coming hey screw off mr zombie man i'm not interested right now but this is this is really good now we have expanded the potential population of the sheep pen of sheep yeah like that boom Cool. Alright, so we're going to keep harvesting wool, obviously, and I'll see you guys in a minute. Oh, well, I was doing some maintenance here. Just check it out. If you right-click, yeah, just like that. Boom! And he's he's now, instead of being gray or brown, they become... Shoot. <laughs> I missed. But either way, you saw the process. I'll use that on the other one when I get some more bone meal. So. So actually, you just saw a very interesting mechanic right there. That I didn't talk during it because I didn't expect to watch it. But this little guy is eating grass as he goes along. So he needs enough grass in order to survive. So this guy over here is kind of... Yeah, it's not healthy to pen him up without an area to grow this style of grass. So, yeah, we'll have to, we'll have to keep him fed that way. Cool. All right. That's all I wanted to show you. Hey, and look at that. Actually, just as the invasion starting, but I'm going to be sleeping here in just a minute. But this all made bacon jerky. But that only actually does a half a hunger bar. So, oh well. Okay, and I'm going to zip on over to the ship. 
as it's beginning to... Whoa, that's some damage. Somebody must have shot an arrow at it. Hmm. Unfortunate. Um, I'm going to get on board of the ship, though. I'm going to sleep real quick, and I'm going to finish out some of the detailing, I think, on all of the sails. I'll get back with you uh, as soon as that's kind of wrapped up. So we'll see you in a minute. Okay, and I'm just finishing the final touches on... Ooh, ah, almost fell one more time. Okay, so there there we are. That As the sun's setting in the background, we have, we have everything, I think, for the most part, together. So check out this monstrosity. This thing's huge. Absolutely massive. And it's very exciting because... Just, I mean, like, look, look at all that sail space. That's a lot of extra room. A lot of vertical space as well. I'm going to have to, like, count up exactly how much that is. I'll do the numbers later. But, yeah, so they're all offset. They're all, like, you know, slightly, slightly tilted. And then I'm thinking we'll make them billow out a little bit. So these are all um, four tall in between with a quadruple stack in the middle. Three along here. So one, two, uh, one, two, three. There, space for sails. So we'll, first one, sitting up on top of it. Next two pushed out next one right at the top so kind of hard to explain but i mean i i think you might get it but if you don't we'll see that whenever we can get enough wool so the next thing i want to figure out is how many blocks have we used we still only okay this is insane this is i'm trying to go big right we've still only used 3661 that's only 36 percent of what we're allowed to use we 36% of the mass of the ship has been used, right? I I don't know how I can push this thing any farther. I At this rate, I could add a third ship across this pontoon system and just make this thing massive. I When I try and run this ship, I will absolutely break my game. Like, I'm pretty sure the server, the computers, just won't actually handle the mod. But that, that remains to be seen. So in this, I'm going to go get a good kind of final image of these ships coming along here. Because this is this is really cool, though. I, I'm very excited. These, these ships look... Well, the, I'm saying plural, but this ship. Because it's a single ship right there. That looks awesome. That looks epic. Wait. Actually, I know where I want to stand. I want to stand right down the middle. It's actually expressly why I made this along here. Oh, look at how badass that looks yep that's screenshot worthy heck yeah okay so thank you all so much for watching this episode of ships ahoy um hopefully we'll be getting to some really epic cool stuff here in the next couple of episodes as we begin to develop forward so thank you all so much for watching and i'll catch you in the next one Bye bye